Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess Today. How are you today? Well, I'm going to make some tags today out of some shabby... Sh I have some um, old book pages and I have some shabby, some uh, coffee tea dyed paper and I have some um, really super vintage-y... It is actually vintage, I think, you guys. It's real kind of thick. Um, I don't know. Fifth Avenue Designs, Covington dies, pre-shrunk, pre I don't know if it, I don't know. I don't know if it's actually, but it looks, it feels, it feel, it's a nice, it's a nice uh, blend, and it feels vintagey. And then I have this Rachel Ray, not Rachel Ray, Rachel Ashwell's shabby chic book that I have, and I thought mm, I might be able to incorporate some of this into the tags, just because I love the, how the colors just kind of go. And then we'll figure out, and then I'm going to put some lace on there. So we're going to do some sewing today and maybe some of this. I don't know. We're just going to just totally play. The first thing I'd like to do is me ooh, measure out some tags on here. And it would be good if I had some tags handy. I'll be right back. So we're gonna, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and do one of these, or one or two, probably one of these files. Maybe two. I have another piece of cardboard over there I can use. So let's start with these. Let's start with these. What the heck? Let's just draw around here and then we're going to cut these. This is gonna be like a little template. Isn't it cute? I thought we could shabby chic some of these up. That'd be fun today. I'm actually gonna use them in a project, so yeah, have them handy. So what's everybody up to? It is Friday and my daughter just left. Oh my gosh, you guys. Let me kind of tell you what happened this weekend. Um, she came down last night, Friday, Saturday night, Thursday night, hello, where am I? And the whole thing was is uh, she lost her phone. Not lost her phone, but broke her phone and we had to get her a new one. I told you about that, I think. So she came down and um, we figured it wouldn't be a big deal. So while we were, uh, we started the backup and the, um, the backup and the um, restore process on her phone, while we were out, we went to Target and I bought her, picked her up a few things. And what else did we do? Oh, she, um, we just spent the kind of, we were out kind of to like, I don't know, nine or something. So then we came home and restored her phone. And then, listen to this, we got her into her car and she was getting ready to leave. And then all of a sudden, um, She's like, Mom, I don't have any service. And I said, when did you notice you didn't have any service? She goes, well, I thought it was just something about the Wi-Fi. So I didn't say anything until I got in my car and I noticed I didn't have any service. This, it's like eight, you know, it's not early, it's not late, but it's, it's eight. And I'm like, oh my word, right? So, okay, so come back in the house. First I sat down in the car for a minute trying to figure it out. There was nothing I could do. Then we got AT&T on the phone. Then we got this girl that could not get her number straight, you guys. I almost said, are you dyslexic? But that would have been completely out of line and, and mean. But it was like, it. she had to have been, you guys. And it was just costing a lot of drama. And I felt really bad for her. I felt really bad for Lauren. I felt really bad for me. <laughs> the whole situation was just insane. So finally, um, she gave, put some, like she escalated it to another person. And that person didn't get it working. What it was doing was they said that it was being um, provisioned and that um, it would start working soon. Well, this morning when I woke up, it wasn't working, and I said, Lauren, it's the SIM card. There, there's there's got to be something wrong with the SIM card. So she ended up spending the night last night, right, you guys, which was great because for me, that's like a little bonus, right? That was my bonus with my daughter, and I didn't mind that at all. So, um, so she spent the night... And then we got up this morning and kind of kicked around a little bit. I had to go buy, okay, get her a book. And, you know, I mean, it was just... But first, before all this drama with the phone happened, lot, yesterday I was going to leave my work around um, 4.30 and meet her. And um, when I left my office, I threw my keys in the trunk, which normally if I do that, the car beeps at me because it was in my backpack. The car usually beeps at me and lets me know that... Hey, you can't do that. You know, you 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 know, your keys are in the trunk. Well, that didn't happen. And so what actually happened was my keys got locked in the trunk. So at 4:30, I'm going to race out of there to go find see my daughter and my keys got locked in. The trunk. So now I'm panicking because I don't know is there any way that maybe they're not going to be able to get them out? 
you know, is this going to be a problem because of that smart key thing, whatever, whatever. Anyway, AAA showed up. I got home by probably 5.30, so it wasn't a big deal. It was almost like as if I just left work, you know. I mean, so no big deal, right? So that, it started out like that, though, right? And then the phone drama. Okay, so get on the phone. Again. So I wake up this morning, and there's still no signal. No signal. No service, it says. No service. And I'm like, okay, so should we let's just lollygagged a little bit. And then we went and picked up her book at Barnes & Noble. And then we um, headed out to the AT&T store to um, get her phone. And yes, we were correct. It's the SIM was bad. The guy thought, at first he scared us. He goes, it could be the motherboard on the phone. These, I, these iPhone 7s do that. I'm like, are you kidding me right now? Lauren looked at me. She's almost in tears, right? We're both almost in tears last night because she really wanted to go home. She had... She had to work today and blah, blah, blah. So anyway, um, that that happened. And so basically, oh, is this one round two? Yeah, this is round two. Um, I think I have a rounder. So basically, yeah, we were, it was just ugh, one thing after another. Um, I don't know where it is right now, so I might have to try to round it myself. See, I'm so disorganized still, you guys. I know you always hear me say that because, well, wait. Because it's true. It's true. It's probably right in front of me and I don't see it. Oh, it's right here. I moved something. I moved stuff. Is it here? Yeah, hold on. Ugh. Anyway. So we were both, it was just really, it was really awful. We shouldn't let things like that get to us, but they did. So anyway, so then we're out and about today and she says to me, I have to be to work at five. I said, okay, that's great. Let's just go have lunch before you go. You know, I want to fill her up, fill up her tummy before she goes, right? All right, here we go again. So we're at Sharky's because we love Sharky's. And she decides to make sure that she knows exactly when she's supposed to be at work. Well, she's supposed to be at work at 5, and it's like 1 o'clock, and she's in Westlake, and she works in Santa Barbara. And, um, yeah, so there was that. So, needless to say, and she's already given her two-week notice, because you remember, you guys, I told you that I told her to because I just want her out of there, you know? Well, the guy, when she said I might be a little bit late, he just added a whole bunch more stress, and he says, you know, you need to be here. Which I said, Lauren, you do. That's your job. You should have looked. You know that. You know this is what you're learning now. This is this is the reality of working and having a life. It's not so bad, is it? And so um, she just started crying again. She's really stressed out right now, you guys. She's got a lot on her mind. So I said, she goes, I just want to quit. And I said, Well, you already did, Lauren. You have to go in today. And she goes, Well, Mom, I don't know. This guy's being really a jerk. And I said, Listen, it's up to you whether you want to like tell him, call him, and say, Look, if that's it, you're, you know, I, I'm done. I mean, that's your your call. I've done it before. I'm not going to say I haven't done that before, you guys. I've quit jobs. I, I actually went out to lunch one time and just did not go back because it was so horrible. And so, you know what? And this is not her career. It's just a summer job. And I get that she's learning stuff, so I, I, I do know that. I do. I get it. But I also know that when she tried to give two weeks notice because she's stressed out anyway, um, what's the point? So, anyway, I'm cutting these over here. I don't know if you can see Anyway, so uh, long story short, she went ahead and, and just called him and said, "Listen, I I am really stressed out today. I I, I you know I'm gonna be late. I, I I really just can't even come in today. You know, I'm telling you, I'm if you, if that's not okay with you, then I'm just gonna have to quit today." And so he says, "Wow, okay, don't worry about it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize. You know, um, don't stress. Give me a call tomorrow. We'll chat. You know." So there's that. So she was able to. Um, get out of working today, which I'm glad, you know, because I can tell when she's stressed out, you know. Being a kid these days is not as easy as we all think it is. As a matter of fact, I think it's harder to be a kid these days than it was when I was a kid because there's so much social pressure. We just didn't have all that constant, constant, constant pressure. So anyway, <laughs> then she goes, then she goes to get in her car and had to park in the guest parking here and her her windshield was covered with poop I mean like covered like she could not get it off with her windshield wiper so here we are standing outside in 90 degree weather with Windex and paper towels wiping covering covering wiping off bird poop and we just looked at each other and started laughing it's like 
this is our life. <laughs> and so at least she started a little laugh and I got a little smile out of her and she took home her casserole and she took home her um, barbecued chicken because I always make barbecued chicken in the crock pot, you guys. And it's the best. And so I feel relieved. Um, I did everything I could for her. I took her to a few thrift stores this morning and yesterday and got her... Actually, I took her to Target yesterday and thrift stores today and got her some more shorts and um, some, um, you know, just some things that she needed. And I got me this. Isn't this pretty? This is going to fall. It always does. So sorry about moving that. Isn't that pretty, you guys? I fell in love with it. It's just so pretty. That was $3 and it's in super good shape. See? It's clean and... It's like almost new. I don't know. I think it's a nice little pencil palette or something, but since I'm not an artist, I don't know why I'm thinking pencil palette. Something. I'll figure out something. So yeah, that was our day, and I just got her off, and I feel like... Oh, and I was supposed to work today, you guys. So yeah, so that was the other thing. So last night when we realized the phone wasn't going to work, I'm like, you're not going back to Santa Barbara with a phone that's not working. I'm not having that. You know, I, you know... So I need to know that my daughter has a cell phone at all times. I mean, you know, she just does. And so, um, so she spent the night here, which is great. It was great for me. And, um, but I was supposed to go to work today and work some OT and get some comp time in, but that didn't happen. And I just think, and I just told her last night, well, that's okay. I don't, I don't care. Don't worry about it. I mean. I was supposed to do something and I go, I can always do it later. Now, it was, de it was it's devastating because now I have to wait two more weeks to be able to have this opportunity. But, um, you know, she comes first. And you know, her health comes first. I bought her vitamins and I bought her some washcloths because I know that I've said before that I don't think that those wipes that people use for their makeup is really good. Now, I use them, but I don't think that they should be used like just, well, I think you need to use washcloths on your face because I honestly feel, I want this to actually go this way. Well, it doesn't really matter, I'm gonna cover it. We'll figure it out. So, how's this one? No, it doesn't matter. Well, this one is this way. It doesn't really matter, right? So, I'm not worried about it. Anyway, so I bought her some washcloths and stuff. I told her she should use those wipes in the in the um, shower to get the makeup off and then use washcloths with a nice creamy creamy um, face cream to wash her face because I honestly don't think that's good. All that pulling and dragging of the skin. So there we go. We have two folders, two four smalls and two large and that'll be fun to work with today and I'm going to keep these out handy where I know where they are. Ha ha ha. That's gonna be a riot. You guys are gonna stick me to that. I'll never find them again probably now that I see. But I'm gonna put them over here like I'm gonna I'm getting more and more organized as we go. Alright, so now what I wanna do is I don't want to leave the backs undone like that, so I'm just gonna cover the backs with some music sheets or something. Um something uh so wait a minute, maybe I'll do the back that's what I'll do. I'll do the material on the front. This is a big piece of material. I think it cost me like, I don't know, 75 cents or something. I just had to have it. And you should see the material I bought at the thrift store today. It's a, a really shabby sheet. Pretty, pretty, pretty tablecloth. Oh, it's going to be so hard to use it, but I'm going to. But I was going to. So, let's see what I mean there. Blah. I don't care how it is. I'm not going to be really picky about the flowers situation. I'm just trying to get a feel for how much I need. So I'll just take, like, okay. I got it. I got it. Okay, from here to, like, I don't know, here. Okay. <sighs> so I just feel like doing something a little different today. I think I'll be pulling out my sewing machine. Maybe. Probably. I feel like it. I've been feeling like it for a while, but when you work, it is so, so hard to have the time to do everything I want to do. You guys have no idea how many projects I have to do. I've got lots and lots going on that I want to do. I want to do them all today. <laughs> I'm sure you know how that goes. So, 
Love these pencil pens. Thank you so much. Oh, isn't this pretty? I just love it. I think it's super pretty. So where's my my pen mark? Where is it? Oh, right here. So here. I thought I made one over here. Oh, there it is. Way over there. Okay. I want this to fall off. Probably will. Not real concerned about how this cut is. There we go. It's a good piece to work with. Pull this up. I love it. I can't wait till I have a. I always say that. I can't wait till I have an organized room. You know, all that. Now, I wonder if you can see this through there. If you can, I don't think you can. No, you can't. Well, you can a little bit, but who cares? Who cares? I'm not going to wrap it or anything. I'm just going to actually seriously just put it on um, the long way. You know what I mean? Not a man. I'm just going to glue it. I'm gluing it. Oh, look at that. It's almost perfect with that, that line right there. So, yeah. You know, the best scissors in the world, but I don't care. I'm not buying a new pair. I work with what I have most of the time, you guys. I really do. I don't try to. I just don't have to. I don't have to be perfect. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to get out this glue, and we're going to get out this glue, and we're going to do the thing that I do with my card. Stubborn. Stubborn. Okay. <sighs> I always miss her so much when she goes, you know, and, um, but I always feel like I'm so glad that I've had a moment to spend time with her. Um, last night it was really nice. We sat on the couch and um, ate some popcorn and watched a little show and then pretty soon she's like, I'm tired. Just like when she was a little girl, she'd, she'd grab me by the hand and say, night, night, mommy. I mean, she'd make me go to bed. <laughs> she was, she did the same thing last night. She was like, mom, I'm tired. I was like, okay. <laughs> so then I'm in my bedroom and, and I went to bed. So guys, are you in there for the swap? The uh, junk journals, the full swap? There's like nobody signing up. <laughs> I was like, okay. That's all right. You know, I get it. Some of you probably don't want to make a flow. It's a lot of work. I totally, totally get it. It's a lot of work and um, there's a lot of rules on this one and that's just the way it is. And so if it doesn't, if it doesn't fly, it doesn't fly. We're, I'm cool with that. I'm not going to trip out. I'm not cool with that. There we go. Here it comes. Silly air conditioners on up there. It's gonna. It's really. This is not coming out of here very good and driving me cray cray. I don't know why. Here I'm just gonna just add a little bit of something diff. Something diff. Something diff. There we go. That's all I want. Just a little bit of something sticky. A little bit of something sticky. There we go. These are just gonna be some inserts and some journals I'm, I'm gonna be putting online pretty soon. Yeah. 
pretty. But it's always sad to see her go, you guys. I always hate it when she goes. I don't like to see her go home. I miss her already. I do, I do. And I know you guys all tell me, you know, enjoy every minute. And I sure try. I mean, there's moments that, you know, during the day, like when we're together so long, it's like, Ur. you know, I get mad at her. Like when, the, you know, she should have called and found out when she was at work. You know, those kind of things. Like a mom knows when her kid's not, you know, whoop knows when her kid's not doing exactly like she should be doing you know come on we we all know you know so I mean she should have known exactly she thought she had to be there at five and but it's okay that's what, you know that's what I'm here for I, I always tell her I got your back honey I got your back nobody had my back I mean my mom had a lot of kids backs you know what I mean so she couldn't do as much as we did you know as much as I'm trying to do for my kid it's just hard it's just hard. Oh, I'm gonna have to get out another piece because this is a long one. I don't even have any wax paper down right now. I'm being a little lay-lay. Being a little lazy. All right. No big deal. I didn't iron these. I normally do, but they're tags. You know, it's not like it's a cover. I have to go to the Dollar Tree later and pick up some stuff. I need Windex and I actually want to try their. Um... Has anybody tried the? Uh... What is that stuff? the um like oxy oxy clean you know that that oxy powder from the dollar tree is that good or bad anybody know anybody know how good that is because i'm gonna try it. for a dollar i don't mind trying it you know i don't mind trying it for a buck so because if it works That'd be awesome. I'll let you know because I have the perfect shirt. I was cooking the other day and I got a big glob of grease right down the front of me. I went, okay. Now I know why they used to wear aprons. Especially if they, you know, were cooks like me. <laughs> Look at that. I'm making a big, huge glue mess today. I normally don't do that, you guys. I usually am kind of careful with the glue. But I'm actually not caring right now for some strange reason. Not giving it too much thought. Really weird. Let's do that. Let's not do that, shall we? So I think I've lost a little bit of weight already this week. I weigh in on Sunday. So I'm glad for that. Get back on track. Oh, I gotta do this one. Cred. Okay, that's fine. So yeah, so get back on track, getting back on track on the weight thing, and tomorrow morning I'll walk because um, I did not have time today. You know, all the phone drama and kid drama. <sighs> I was so scared when my car's, my keys got locked in my car because you know, it's not one of the, I have like one of those push button things in my car and you, you know, those smart keys, you just get in your car and you throw them down, which I don't like that at all. I need a key. I, I'm old school. Give me back my key. But anyway, um, so, um, yeah, when that lock got locked in the car, I was thinking, how, how does that work? You know, but the door, it's not the key that matters. It's the door the door uh, lock and the lock pulls out like that so that's why it works so I'm like thank goodness and the kid was really nice all I had on me was three dollars to tip that poor kid and I had to borrow that from some one of my co-workers I said you got any cash I go all I got is three bucks I got 
Can I borrow it till tomorrow? Which is tomorrow. Tomorrow's the day and I didn't go to work, so I still owe her. So, maybe I'll bring her a little flower and $3 or something. I don't know. Something. One more. One more on here. Yay, we're gonna have some shabby chic, shabby chic tags, guys. I'm, all, I'm good with that. You can use them for a lot of different, a lot of different things. Vintage journals, you can use them for just anything. So I'm excited, whoopsie. Excited to using up all this craft bond stuff. It's probably a really expensive blue that I'm like, you know, tossing around like it's nothing. Isn't that funny? Oh well. Oh well, you'll have that. Okay. There we go, last one. Sticky, sticky. Let's just throw this mess away. Let that dry. I know I could wipe it off, but I don't have any wipes. I'm not a big wipe, uh, what do you call it, fan? Baby wipe, I don't have a lot of those. I don't know why I'm using very often. Probably should. Turn it over. Such pretty material. I just love the ink, the old shabby look of it. You can kind of see the cereal box through and that's fine. I'm not worried about it. Not worried about it at all because I'm going to embellish it a little bit. Some lace. And, oh, where's that wrinkle at? Oh, good. So I didn't like that. Okay, so let's trim these up. See how this goes. So thanks for hanging out with me today. I know you got lots to do. So, yeah. Hey, if anybody knows where to get a five hole punch, let me know, I need one. I can't find one online anywhere, you, new or used. Or the ones that are new, new are like $500. It's like, what? No thanks. I am not paying that price. Ever. So I looked at the thrift stores. I've been, cause sometimes you'll find stuff like that, you know, like old office supplies at thrift stores, so. I wonder how this is gonna look. It's probably not going to be perfect. <laughs> I'm actually okay with that. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, see, I think a little, a little, uh, a little lace will work wonders. See, not bad. Yeah, perfect. Perfecto. There we go. Isn't that cute? Little shabby chic thing. And then we will add something to it in a minute. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. I wait to get out my sewing machine and some lace and I think we'll do that first after I cut these out we'll do some sewing and then I need to figure out somebody told me what size needle to get to go through thicker paper so if you just happen to be listening could you tell me again because I'm not a sewer and I have no clue what I'm doing Okay, this is gonna go in my junk jar, I think. I'll put that over here for now. It's a good size to do something with. <sighs> so I'm sure a lot of you think that I might um, maybe coddle or spoil my daughter. Um, but please remember that I've always been a single mother and I've never been a rich person and we have never We've always had <laughs> the crappiest house in the, of all the people she knows, and um, even though I thought it was okay, I mean, it's just, we live in such a, na oh, such a ritzy, toity-toity neighborhood that, um, you know, it was not, never as nice. I mean, come on. She went to school with Lionel Richie's daughter, Sophie. We, you know, when she went to her house, she came home and she had eyes as big as saucers, like, Mom, her closet's as big as our condo. I said, Lauren, that's Lionel Richie's daughter. You know, she has a manny, you know, instead of a nanny, she had a manny and he picked her up, brought her home, made her macaroni and cheese and brought it to them. And Lauren was like, oh my God, mom. I said, Lauren, mommy can't compete. <laughs> 
but so she's not spoiled but I have never let her feel less than because of the financials you know what I mean I never when it was tough for us I never like let her ever know it I remember when there was a time when she was in school and you had to bring cookies and stuff and I was like I couldn't even afford first off my my oven never ever worked well in my condo ever and there was a time when I had to bring cookies all the time I don't remember why but what I did was I found this recipe online where you use a cake mix to make cookies and you make you can make chocolate cookies lemon cookies all these cookies with a cake mix cake mix and an egg and wa water or something and you just make the and you press I mean and they're just like these little round cookies they're not but the kids loved them and I mean those are the kinds of things I had to do you know I never I mean I was not the chocolate chip brownie mom I was those weird cookie mom <laughs> you know but you know it worked the kids loved them so and I I did shop the Dollar Tree and the 99 cent store and stuff back then so I mean I did what I could and and to this day, my kid does not mind going to thrift stores with me. She's really good, you know. She found a couple of her shorts and some shirts and a cute little, you know, she found some cute halter tops. And I'm just so proud of her that, you know, she can be raised in that, that and that's a pretty one, in that area that she was in and still be very down to earth. So for those that think I might, I think you might think that because you hear about her with me all the time because she's my only one. And she is my life. She's, I... I wanted a child, I had her late in life, and um, I had her when I was 39, and um, after I had her, I just, I, I just cozied up with my daughter and stayed, you know, very, very, just, I, was, I'm, I went into mommy mode, and I went into mommy mode just so happy and so glad and so, so grateful, you know, that I had my, my little girl. I was so grateful that I had her, so, um. So you'll hear a lot about her and think, wow, what a spoiled kid. But she's not. She drives a, an old beater car, which I, w I told her today I think she needs to look at the Kelly Blue Book on it and maybe try to get rid of it um, because it's starting to be a, a, a nickel and dimer. And, um, you know, I'll, I'll help her a little bit. Her dad can help her a little bit more. Um, I had a conversation with him this week. I said, you know, I actually got a phone call from Lauren a couple weeks ago, you guys. She was hungry. She's like, Mom, I'm on my way home. From she didn't say I'm on my way home. She goes, Mom, oh, that was it. S H I T show. She calls me and says she's hungry and wants something. Could I order her a pizza? I'm like, Absolutely, I can do that, right? So I order her a pizza, and then I talk, and then I FaceTime her, and the background looked weird. And I'm like, Wait a minute, where are you? She goes, I'm at work. And I said, Lauren, I thought you were at home. She goes, No, I told you, I'll be home. I'm gonna be home later to order me a pizza later. And I'm like, Well, it's on its way. Oh, that turned into a shit so. But anyway, so, um, yeah, so I told her dad. I said, we can't have that. You need to kind of, I mean, he's really, really good. But guys don't stop and think about it. He goes, I fill up her gas tank, and I take her to dinner, and this and that. You know, I go, well, you know, you have to do that more than once a week. I mean, but he's really good. I'm not coming to complain. But I did tell him, I just need you to do, can you just, can you either get her a gas card, or can you, um, you know, um, I don't know. Maybe give her a little bit more cash. He says, I can do better. And I said, <laughs> I was like shocked. You go, what? So yeah, okay, well then do better. We got this. If he, if he does better, I mean, because I cook for her and bring her food and stuff all the time. So if he could do that, that would be great. And this pretty, I don't want to get rid of that. See, I'm kind of weird. Okay, this is a pretty one too. Uh, can't keep everything. Can't keep everything, guys. Although this, I love to line my... Oh, okay, I gotta have that. I like this for my junk journals. All right, so now we've got these little tags. Before I sew, obviously I have to do the backs really quick. I forgot about that. So we have to line these backs. Aren't they cute? Super cute. Little shabby chic tags. So we'll line the backs now with, I have some of this book. I might use some of this book for the smaller ones. And I might use some of this, uh, this shabby chic book for the these. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Why not? Ooh, that's pretty. I'll use that for something. The colors just work. You know what I mean? This would be good for. 
Maybe one of these, or is it too long? Oh, where'd it go? Oh, no, I think it's just right. Oh, yeah, perfect. So we'll do one of those. And I like that. I like that. I like that a lot. I know it's got a picture on it, but that's okay. I don't care. I don't care. I like it. I like it. I'm going to use this one for the other big one. See, I use the heck out of these. Don't I? That's pretty. And we have maybe some paper. Look at that. That's just pretty. I like the colors on that. Okay. So let's go ahead and glue some of these down on here. You know, just to see what happens. Just to see how it goes. I feel like these are my fingers, but. Is this ever gonna come out of here the right way? Probably not. I don't know why, I don't know. I mean, I could taste it. <laughs> I could taste it, it's trying. But it's just like stuck. I don't wanna kill my hands trying to do that, you know what I mean? Nothing is worth killing your hands for. Especially us crafters, we need our hands, right ladies? We need our hands. So. I got, that got stuck. It everywhere. Hold on, let me roll this off my hands. Oh, look what I got the other day. Isn't this collected you says to roll this down? There we go. Actually, those flowers would have been pretty. Dang it. Dang it. Lost opportunity. Missed opportunity. Dang it. But not terrible. That's okay. That's okay, because this is pretty too, you know? I just think the color's pretty. I just think the color's pretty. Oops. Let's just try it with this today, right now, and see what happens. So this will probably be a pretty long video. I don't know. I'll be chatty here and there, but oh, that's so pretty. But I got glue all over it. Dang it! I just love the soft in the back though, so I'm fine. I'm fine. We're fine. We're fine with it. We're Yeah, it's one of the, I told my daughter, sometimes you're the bug and sometimes you're the windshield, right? Remember that old country song? Isn't that pretty? It's just really light and soft. I just love that. That's fine. Sometimes you're the bug and sometimes you're the windshield. Isn't that a country song? Today, this week, I think we both felt like the bug. <laughs> I really do. I really like these tags, you guys. I really do. <laughs> Super pretty. Yeah, I don't like this one as much as I like that one. That's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna use it again because I actually like that really soft look. I like it.
Turn off their glue. Get off their glue. Now you know why my scissors are such a mess. I use them for glue, I use them for fabric, I use them for paper. Don't care. Me no care. <clears throat> I think I put too much glue on here. I can tell because it's curling. That means it's really wet. Probably was not a good idea. I mean, yeah. See, yeah, definitely too much glue on this one. Bad idea. It's all right. Just a tag. Oh my goodness. Well, we'll have to put something there. Okay. Let that dry. Let that dry. All right. So we've got some of those. I wanted to use this on this one. It's just pretty. probably like enough on that side. Yeah, I bet it is. I'm overdoing the glue, so. I remember there's gonna be some sewing involved eventually. Mm -hmm. This is going to be the inside of the folder, just so that it's not an ugly beige or brown, you know, cardboardy color. loved Rachel Ashkowal. She used to have a, a sh shop in um, Malibu that I'd go to. I mean, I never bought, but I when I went down to, it's called, it was called Malibu, it still is, Malibu Country, Malibu Country Market or something. I used to take my kid there and she'd play in the, um, in the area, you know, in the kids area. And we just walk around, because it's just pretty. It's right on the ocean. It's really gorgeous. I can't remember, Malibu Country Mark, but it's anything but country. <laughs> It's very upscale -y. It's got, like, a really nice sushi place. I mean, everybody goes there that's somebody um, here, you know, in L.A. So, but, um, yeah, let's, let's let these dry. Yeah, it's buckling a little bit. We don't care. It does not have to be perfect. It does not have to be perfect. You know. Okay. Let's see what happens. I might not have put enough glue on there. But remember, we're going to sew, so that will help. Sewing will help a whole lot. So let's put some bookmarks on the back. I think I really want to do some bookmarks. I'm not loving the way this is actually adhering. So where's that little book? Where's my little tiny book that I had handy? Okay, right here in front of me. Right cheer. Okay. So I don't know whatever happened to her. Is she? I don't think she's still a thing. You know, like a still like she doesn't have a. She had a show on TV, I think, for a minute. And um, you know that kind of stuff. I don't think she has any of that going on right now. Kind of like that Rachel Zoe. Do you guys remember her, the fashion girl? She was cute for a minute. And then, you know, I think having a show and all that, it just gets to be too much. I mean, I wouldn't know. You know? I always said I'd rather, I want to be rich, but I never want to be famous. So, I don't think I'm going to get either. <laughs> At this rate. And I'm actually okay with that. Those, that's what, that was what I wanted way back when. I don't want that now. I just want to be comfortable, but that'll never happen. I mean, you're never going to be, see, that's good. You'll never be actually secure in this world. There's really no such thing as security. I don't care what anybody says. There is no such thing as security these days. Just not. Mm. 
Not these days. I mean, was there ever? I mean, we always had something going on in the world that made us feel uh, nervous. But we still have it better than most. So, I'm going to try to get that act one in there. Did I? Yay, I did. Oh, the hole's probably going to go right through it. Yep. Oh, well. Nobody knows. That's okay. So, yeah, we're going to try to do some um, sewing, but the, the, um, the uh, needle might go th not go through this cardboard as well as I would like it to, so I don't know if I'm going to stop and go get the right, or try to find the right needle, or if I'm just going to go ahead and um, continue on, I don't know. Okay, so on this one right here, we're going to use this paper right here. Let's see what that looks like. And I, ooh, we're just going to put it right there in this spot, too. Good idea. Good idea. Good to be hanging out with you guys doing a whole lot of nothing today because I feel like the last like yesterday was so stressful oh and then when my daughter spent the night last night she she had remember I told you like about a week ago she called me and she was in tears like mom I can't sleep I'm coughing no it was like four o'clock in the morning and she texted me I'm in tears I can't sleep I've been coughing I said Lauren I think it's your allergies you're in that big dusty place and you know you've got to go to um, go to, uh, what do you call it, um, urgent care tomorrow, right? So she did, and yes, I was right, it was her allergies. So needless to say, uh, this is gonna be a cool one. Needless to say, um, uh, she, I think she's kind of getting to where she feels like she might be getting allergic to our kitties again since she hasn't been around them. So I gave her a Benadryl last night. Well, that didn't really help because in the middle of the night she was coughing and coughing and coughing. And so I'm like, I'm like, okay. You know what, I probably shouldn't have kept this folded, but I guess it's gonna be okay. Actually, it's not gonna be okay. Look at you guys, I screwed this up. Oh, how can I fix this? I can't. You guys, I should have laid it flat because it doesn't want to open up good. That was a dummy. Actually, you know what, yes I can, I can just. I'm going to pull it off and put another one on there. Because if you don't do it, how am I going to sew it? Boy, that, that's some good glue. Look at that. That is some good glue. Really good. Did you see that? Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Let's try that again. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be weird. This is a weird one. Oh, well. We got a deal. See, I want it to be flat because I want to sew it. And I tried to be all clever. Live and learn. Watch and learn. <laughs> Watch and learn what not to do. Right? But never be afraid to undo it. Just It's just paper. It's just, this is just not expensive stuff, so. Don't freak out. So yeah, I can line that up, but I still want to go like this. There we go. And I don't care if it's bumpy. Don't care. There we go. I'm feeling better now about it. A little gluey here and there, but that's okay. It's all right. It's all good. So then I couldn't sleep because she was coughing. And I told her, I said, this is why you sound tired all the time because you can't possibly be getting enough sleep when this happens, she goes, Mom, this doesn't happen all the time anymore. I just, it's because of the cats. I'm like, okay. Boy, don't we worry about our kids, you guys? Isn't it crazy? It's just crazy. Look up to see if you're still with me. This is already at almost 50 minutes, so I might post it as part one, chill, chill and chat part one, because this is gonna be a chill and chat, because I've been chatty. I'm not talking about too much great stuff, but I've still been chatty. All right, let's do another one of these. 
And then I'm going to clean up my mess. And then I'm going to pull out the sewing machine. And I have no idea what we're going to do, but we're going to do something on the sewing machine because I'm dying to. Ugh, I'm getting glue everywhere. Glue everywhere. down here and then uh, yeah, let me go. I need to roll, roll my fingers off or something now. Probably should get some baby wipes. Oops. Yeah. It's Gerald's in. I know. I don't know. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna freak out about it. That's why you can roll it off. That's why you can roll it off. I just love these little tags. They're so cute. Clean up my disaster area, the glue, the mess. Wash that card off so I can actually use that again. And um, put some of this stuff away. And I will be back with a, um, um, sewing machine and some lace and we'll, we'll go on from there. So. I'll see you guys in a few minutes, okay? We are back. Okay, I've got this kind of situated. I hope you can kind of see what I'm doing. I'm just going down with some white thread. Um, and then I'm going to just turn it. Well, it would help if the, the thing was in it when I turned it. I'm not a very good sewer, you guys, so please don't, don't judge. I'm just using white thread because I just want it to be simple. And um, I'm not too worried about it being um, perfect, you know. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just not, a, you know, I don't have to, I don't have to be perfect. I'm just, yeah, I'm just, go back a little bit. I don't know. I just want, I just want, <laughs> I don't know why that gets caught up in there. I just want the, um, the sewing on there. I'm not real concerned. Oh, you guys can see me. Sorry. Lost a couple pounds. I'm feeling pretty good. So see, there's a little bit of sewing. I don't know if you can see it. So yeah, so that's going to be really cute. So let's do another one really quick. Let's see if I can make it. I got the boxes in my way down here and everything. Let's do another one. I probably shouldn't be doing this yet because I know there's probably some glue in there still. better because I'm actually following this edge right here. Sewing machines don't smell as good as they used to when I was a kid. I used to love to sit with my mom and watch her sew. I love, somebody told me they thought it was the sewing machine oil that I loved. Probably. Okay. Probably. Cute, nice little stitched taggy. Let's do another one. Ooh, this is fun. I always forget how fun it is to sew. I'm a, I love it. I've always wanted to make like a quilt or something, but I better I better leave that to the big girls, <laughs> like the Beckys and my sister. 
If I made a quill and my sister got a load of it, oh my god, she'd die. She would probably just go, don't even try, Dumri. You don't, you're not a very uh, detailed oriented person. And you guys know that about me. I'd make a mess out of it. But see, with me, I'm okay with that. I mean, as long as it's got some, you know, I don't know. As long as it keeps me warm and it's pretty. I don't care if it's perfect. She's made everybody in the family a quilt but me. <laughs> even the sister-in-law has got one. Not even me. I don't even know what the hell. That's not fair. Like, really? I'm your sister. I'll show you my... Wonderful handiwork. <laughs> Becky, look away, look away, look away from the screen. Look away, look away, look away. I'm so glad that you guys are in a judgmental community. And this is, by the way, is going through fine. This is, I better knock wood. This is the first needle I got with this sewing machine, you guys. And it's still, right, okay. And it's still, it's, I haven't broke it yet. Ooh. Not wood. I don't want to, you know, I'm scared. I scared. So I think I told my sister, well, how come you made me a quilt yet one time, you know? And she was like, well, because I, I kind of want like an all white one, like real subtle pink, really light, so that I, it can be, you know, going to. Somebody told me you can um, use like chlorine bleach to, to do it, so I would have to do that. So I think I scared her thinking I was going to bleach her quilt. But I've got two cats, and ha truth be known, they uh, make a mess. They make a bigger mess than I do. I'm going to wait to do these. That gives us a few more minutes to dry up. So, yeah. That way, if the if they get, if the needle gets wrecked, I still have these to play with today. I'm still going to sew some more on here. I just wanted to do this outline. I don't know why. I'm going to sew some lace and Whatever. What evs? I should sometime make myself a quilt. I don't care, you know. I don't. I know exactly what fabrics I like. Just really soft, light fabrics. Real, real light. Okay. Oh, wait. Is this one sewn? No. I'm going to sew this one first. I think those other ones are still wet. I can really kind of feel the glue. I almost feel like don't doing it yet. But... This would have been pink with a pretty with a pink thread, right? Well... You never know until you know. Okay, there's that. Kind of good. Kind of good. Oh my god, did the bobbin get wrecked? But it doesn't. I am so grateful right now that the bobbin hasn't caused me any drama right this second. I must have done a good job on fixing that bobbin. All right, let's go. We're going in. We're going in. I'll just try to wipe the needle off or something. I don't know. I guess it's not the needle I'm worried about. It's the innards. I'm being really stupid right now, I think. Ooh. I'm gonna stop. Is it? I'm gonna stop because you know what? If if the glue gets down in there, that's when you're gonna have a problem, right? I, I wouldn't even know what to do. And this is definitely wet. It's still really cold. So oh, I hope I haven't done anything wrong. I have to like this a little bit. Maybe I'll just. I know what I'll do. I know what I'll do. Where's that? Where's that? Where's this? Where's that? Where's that scare? Scare. Here. Oh heck. Here, I'll find some in here. I just want some spare um 
this just to maybe help clean off the, you know what I mean? Let's just clean off the needle a little bit for what I just did. Let's hope that that helps. You know what I mean? Maybe that'll help. I don't know what I'm doing. You guys are probably thinking, well, she doesn't even, definitely knows what she's doing. But I'm just hoping that maybe this will help a little bit by cleaning it off. I don't know. I'm not gonna sew anymore until those are completely dry. That scared me just now. Oh, I can use these as some tag things for my book. <laughs> we'll do that, not for my book, but for my junk journal. Okay, so there we go, there's that. So I'm gonna move you back over. Hey guys, I'm back. I've been really busy today. I went running around and I dyed some um, lace, as you can see here, I just tea dyed it. Uh, these are all set to go. I was digging through my stash and I found these. They said handmade by me. So me, thank you very much. I don't remember who me is, but I love these. And I thought these would look really, really pretty on a couple of these. And so yeah, I'm going to use them. So, you know, I want to, I actually want to just use these little red ones maybe on a few of these and maybe some of these blue ones. I think that would look pretty because there's a little bit of bluey green in there I don't know you know why not it looks good so we're gonna kind of make them a little similar but that's okay this would look oh look at that that pretty gorgeous so there's that so I think I'm gonna do that on those and then maybe make a little clut I don't know if I'm gonna put these on the folders or not actually this one fell off but we can always put that back wherever or probably like right here or something these are cool I love them. So thank you very much, me. Oh, there's a, there's a pretty one in here. Another one. This is gorgeous. She made them out of beads. Super cute. So thank you so, so much. So, so much. S-E-W. So yes, I'm going to sew on some, um, some of the lace and put these in here. Then I'm going, I was going to ink around the edges, but I don't think I want to. I mean, Let's just try it on one, if I can find my ink. And I, because I did buy, I bought some more of these dauber things right here today. This was coming off of here. That's not supposed to do that, is it? I think what I'll do is I'll have to like cement glue this back on here. So let me stick that back in there. Hammer it back in or something. I'm hammer that. Hang on. I'll so I do have some Velcro, so I can always put another piece of Velcro on here. Not a big deal. Pick some of this up today. Gracie's here. She wants to see what's going on. She's like, hi, Mom. So yeah, I wanted to see how how this works. So let's do some of this tea dye. That's appropriate, isn't it? And then doesn't this go on here like that? Yeah, right? Is that how that goes? Okay, but you need to kind of come over there and sit, honey. Let's try one of these. Let's try this one. No, if this is might be too dark. Actually, that's okay. That's not See, with material, you know, it's a little different than than inking the edges of a. Um, yeah, I think that's fine. It gives it a little bit of depth. Yeah, I like it. Not too dark. I don't know. Maybe I'd like something a different color. I don't know. But we'll use this for this. Actually, I'll I'll just go ahead and do them because I actually like it. I think it's fine. Let's see if there's a difference. I mean, I think there is a little bit of a difference. I think it looks good. What do you think? A little, little different. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a couple of these and we'll sew some lace on. We'll put that on there. So yeah, we gotta poke holes. Let me find a hole poker. Poke some holes. Gracie's like, boy, mom, you're sure busy today. I don't know if I should use this hole poker or my other hole poker. I think we'll try this hole poker. If I go through the lace or the, if I go through the sewing, it doesn't matter, right? Am I right? It doesn't really matter. I'll just knot though. I'll just go right below it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, that's not gonna work. I have this other thing that will work really good. This hole poker is a really good hole poker. My crocodile. Yeah, we like that hole poker. This hole poker. 
is not good for an old lady fingers, right? My little old lady fingers. I don't feel like an old lady, but my fingers sure do sometimes. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, something fell out of there. I don't know. So let's see. So it's, I always got to remember how to work this. Oh yeah, so you go like so, open it up. And I'm going to use this big side. There we go. Ugh, it's not long enough. Oh wait, my bad. I can move it. We have the power to move this, right? Doesn't this move? There we go. We didn't just break that. I gave it the old... I don't know why that was so... Anyway, sorry. Okay. Yeah, there we go. There we go. We're back. <laughs> How easy was that, may I ask? Much easier. Okay, that was a little crooked. <laughs> I could try to be a little bit more careful, couldn't I? There we go. Much better. Muy bueno. Much better. That's the big side, right? Yeah, that's the big poker. See? Just need something to add a little tag to. A little... There we go. See? I, I really do want a, a big hole punch thing that can do multiple holes and you know I really do so yeah looking at that I think that this gives it a little bit of something something so I wonder if there's another color what's this one right here you guys what about this vintage photo this might be all dried up so let's try this one because this is something I just bought mm, let's try it we shall try it Stuff off here. These are these oxides that you can, um, I don't know. Oh yeah, that's better. This actually has, oh that looks so much better, of course. Of course it does. Looks more finished, I have to agree. All right, I agree. Let's just do this a little bit, hit this one a little bit more. They look vintagey. They look shabby. -y. Pretty tags. Sew on a little bit of lace now and maybe add some ephemera to them as we go. But I think today I'll just add some um, some little flowers to these and leave them kind of simple. You know. But thanks for hanging out with me today. A little chillin' chat sesh. I went out in the middle of this. I tea dyed these papers, and then I went over to the, um, it's, Joanne's bought some of these things, daubers, whatever they're called. Oh, I didn't put that on my fingers. And, um, I mean, I know I could use those makeup sponges, but, um, I just think this does a better job. It really does, actually, for some reason. And I had the thing, I just didn't have the the daubers, the tops. I had the handle. So, I don't know. Okay. Kind of dirtied that up, didn't I? I like it, though. I actually think it looks good, so... I mean, yeah. Finished. I think we're used to seeing dye finishes. I don't do it on everything, you guys, but um, for what I'm doing, using these for, which you'll probably see in a a couple weeks or maybe longer. It's going to take me a while. Um, I, I just think this would be nice. Okay. Jeez. So what did somebody else do? They like tape them on the bottom so they have the one that they used on there like so? Did I see somebody do that one time? Or just leave it in there? Oh, I don't know. I'm not going to be all... I'm not going to be perfect. <laughs> I can't be. Okay. So these are our laces. This is a cute lace. I think this will look pretty on along the side here. So I'm probably just gonna do one on the side. Or should I just keep them on the bottom? Maybe I'll just keep them on the bottom. I think they look better on the bottom. All right, so I'll sew some on the bottom. Just like so. Actually, I could just glue it. But I'd rather sew it. I don't know a little bit. Okay, so 
that one's for that. We'll sew them. Let's sew them, shall we? And then let's do one like this. I want to do a couple with that. I love that. That's pretty. But they ha you have to have like a smaller, you know, the smaller the, like this one's good for that actually. I think these need to have the bigger ones. Don't you? Because they're a bigger, yeah. So we'll do that. And then we'll do the smaller ones on here. That's all I did for the smaller ones. I think I have more, but I don't think they're dry. I actually have not thrilled with this little lace, but we'll go with it. Okay, let's go sew. Let's Hold give on. this a sew, shall we? Let's give this a little sewing. Sew some lace on this puppy. It's hard to see what I'm doing. I think I should go, no I can't. Doesn't have to be perfect because because you can't see it really because of the lace. You know what I mean? I see it a little bit, but not bad. Hmm, that cute. I think that looks fine. Yeah, it's darling. Okay, let's do another one. Let's do another one. Again, I can't help but think about my mom when I'm sewing. It's not like she was a big sewer either. Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to say that at all. But she was the first person I ever saw sew. And uh, my grandmother had an old sewing machine. I don't remember seeing her sew. She was always out back with the chickens and the... <laughs> you got me. You, I, you heard me right. And the rabbits and her, and her garden. And she was such a hardy woman. Just very, very self reliant that way so yeah. very cute oh I love these whipping them up you guys okay so let's see what we're gonna do with these guys let's see what we're gonna do with these guys there's kind of a front and a back on here and it's hard for me to see but I guess where I can see that seam so we're gonna that there and hope for the best. I think probably gluing these down would be a really good idea before you sew it, but you know, I don't have always, I just do. Good enough, right? I'm just backing it up a little bit. Oh, that's cute. It's sweet. And it's perfect because it's right there in the center. So yeah, another little, another little, little lacy tag, little shabby chic tag. So cute, right guys? Oh, I just dropped one, hold on. Pardon me, pardon me. Pardon my reach. I don't know if you could see me just now. <laughs> my ugly profile. Okay, aren't those cute? I love them, so cute. Super cute, super cute. Okay, let's do another one. Another three. Yeah, I like this little daintier thread lace for the smaller ones. It's cute. It's a cute little piece. Keep it. Sorry if the lighting is not that great, but that's the way this place is. There is there is really, literally no lighting in here. Like it's since I moved in here, I cannot believe like how dark it was. My condo was so light and bright. I mean, you know they say that, but it really, literally, it really was. It was so light and bright. Um, however, the bedrooms here are um, I the light shines in but it's not a bright light it's just light you know which is awful so in my other one I was spoiled because I had some dark out um, blackout uh, blinds that I bought I spent a fortune for I left them there 
It's part of the deal. It's a real bummer. But, hmm, what are you gonna do? Hey, I got the better end of that deal. I really think I got a good deal, and I think they got a good deal too, don't get me wrong. But I really feel that I got out at the top of that market. So, and you can't blame me for that. There's nothing, there's no law against that. Am I right? No law against that. I don't want to have to cut through that, but I won't. I'll just... Yeah, I will a little bit. There we go. Super cute, super cute. Okay, two more. Now we got to figure out what to do with those files. Not sure yet. Not too sure yet. We'll figure something out. Again, fast forward if you get the gist here, guys. Unless you want to hang out with me and just listen to me yammer, jammer, which I will be happy to do. <laughs> I will be happy to yammer at you. I see that some of you, since I last talked to you, uh, have already started the... Look at their thread on both sides, so now I don't even know which is front, which is back, which is oh, whatever. I'm not going to be all picky. But I see that some of you signed up for the flow swap. I'm excited. We're doing international. I mean, there's two people on there already for international, and I'm doing one too, so. So, yeah. So, just remember that. There's, it's gonna, it's international. International is welcome. Hopefully, we'll get enough internationals. I can't do two internationals because, well, number one, I've only got one, one flow that I made for this swap, and that would be a lot of money to do two flows to international, so. Oh, I wish I could. I really do. I'm really happy that I didn't that I tea dyed this and didn't leave it white, you guys. I think it looks just better. Much more better. Much more better. Mm-hmm. So I can't I can never tell what this front and back is. So I just go, whatever, it's cute. Nobody's gonna look that close, right? If somebody's sitting here going, hmm. Well, you know, I would say you need to go uh, watch more videos. <laughs> Uh-oh, look what happened. My thread came out. That's okay. At least I caught it right out the gate. So, I'm not too worried about it. There we go. Let's put this down so I can actually see what I'm doing. Yes, I'm going to make you hang out with me while I struggle with my this. Because, oh gosh, looks like it might go pretty easy if I could find the... Um, no, hold on. Because I'm just like that. I'm just selfish like that. Make it look at that tea dyed fingers and all. I can't find the hole, and there's no light. Won't that be a bummer someday? Oh, I think I got it. When you actually just can't see that, that will be such a bummer. They've got to come up with a better way for people like large books in like large um, print. They have to come up with large. Sewing machines. <laughs> I don't know. I think I drugged that. Um, oh well. Good enough. Ooh, my little fingers look dirty, but it's actually tea dye. I promise you guys. I promise. I'm not going to really cut that off. It looks cute kind of hanging over the side like that. I don't mind that. I mean, doesn't it? It's fine, right? Yeah, it's cute. Okay, so there we have it. We have our little things. And so now, let's go back over and we will and put some little flowers on them. Okay, I'll be right back. Hi, I'm we'll back. Go. Okay, so these are all sewn and they've got the lace on there and they look adorable. Don't they look adorable? So, let me get that out of the way. Um... Yeah, those are super cute. I like the smaller lace with the and the longer. And then I went ahead and sewed sewed these, added a little bit of lace to them as well. Um, since they're file file folders, I do think I'm just gonna go ahead and leave them plain, um, just like so. I might round these. I'm not sure. But aren't those cute? I just think those are so cute. I'll stick those in something. This one needs to be flattened out, but that's okay. That will happen over time. I'll just stick it under a dictionary for a minute. It'll straighten right out. But aren't those pretty? Cute. Super cute. 
So yeah, so that's really cute. Okay, so those are, I think those file folders are done. We don't need to embellish them, but I do want to put a few little um, of these on here. So I might, let's see. I think just one. I don't want to make a big deal, you know. And so I'm just going to go ahead and use the Aileen's glue because um, Aileen's just makes everything hold. It really does. It's a good, good tacky glue. Actually, I do have some Fabri-Tac. Let me grab that. Hold on a second. I'm just going to make you stay with me because otherwise I'm going to have to figure out which video is what. So hold on. <laughs> um, Fabri-Tac, Fabri-Tac. Where is the Fabri-Tac? down here somewhere. Hold on guys, I got it. I just got it. This is good, because I am working with fabric here, so I might as well use it. I, I am kind of um, stingy with the Fabri-Tac because it's very expensive. <laughs> Otherwise I'd probably use it a lot. So, well, I probably should use it more than I do because it's getting a little, you know, We'll just hang on a second. And then we gotta figure out what we're gonna put through the holes for the tags. Tabs, oops. Tabs. These little flowers are pretty. I don't remember who sent them to me, but thank you. Thank you for your thoughtfulness. And please remind me who you are so I can shout you out in the comments. Oh, pretty. Super cute, just a little something something. Not a big deal. I like simple. Simple, simple pleasures for a simple girl, I guess. There we go. Those are cute. Mm -hmm. That's kind of a big one, isn't it? But that's okay. I love it. It's pretty. Let's put that. Yeah, let's go ahead and put that there. I like the sparkle on it. I like the sparkle and the shine. Why not? It's pretty. She made those out of seam binding, you guys. Isn't that precious? Just precious. Put that on this side. Different sides because like this, you know, the flowers are, you know what I mean? I'm kind of letting the flowers shine. Ooh. I love this. I love these. It's cute little, cute little hand sewn, um, Hang on, you guys can put this back on there. This stuff will come glopping out. Cute little hand sewn tags with darling little, wouldn't that be pretty like under there too though? That would be cute, right? A little, another little trick, but no, again, just keep it, keep it simple, Dawn. I kind of do want to cut that off because I don't like the way it hangs over it now that I'm looking at it. Sorry. There we go, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, I like that better. I'm, I'm, I guess I'm, what do you call it? AC, I'm ACDC. <laughs> you guys know what I mean. You know what I'm talking about. All right, so there's that. So we need to find it, just some cute little, um, aren't those pretty? Kind of cute. Simple, simple and sweet. Not a big deal. I mean, I might do more on these when I use them, but now I'm just kind of leaving them as a base so that they are ready to use in whatever I want to do. Like if I'm doing a, a doll journal, I can put dolls on here. If I'm doing a plant journal, I can put flowers on here. If I'm doing, um, you know, a Buddha journal, I can put something simple here. I mean, even that would go, you know, because these are, these are simple and fine. So let me dig through my, um, my treasures. See what we got, that's blue. That might go good with the blue one. And we have, oh, some, ooh, look, hello. Might clash, but I might, I don't know. I need some more of this kind of seam binding, you guys. Where do you get that? Everybody has it but me. Okay, I've got a little bit that somebody's, oh, I got enough here. There we go. Now we're cooking with Crisco. I think it's that seam binding in there. I think these you've dyed it yourself or something. Am I right? I'm just going to use this because it's, it's it won't clash. You know what I mean? This is fine. It just for all of them. It works good. All right? What you think? This one would be great with these though. Or 
Or is it far enough away that you can't really tell that it doesn't match perfectly? I think that's okay. I think that's my story and I'm sticking to it. So we'll use this on those. Put that through the little hole. So I guess I have to break down a buy. I think there's you can buy a roll of this um, seam binding at Amazon. I just haven't done that yet. I need to do that. I gotta get off my duck. So that's cute. A little hand sewn. Well, hand sewn. Well, you know what I mean. Not really hand sewn, but sewn. Um, tag. So cute. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know it's not my normal chill and chat with the fatty patty, but I think that's going to be coming this weekend as well. I've got a lot to do. Um, I'm going to try to stay in and do a lot of crafting this weekend. I really am. Um, I want to do that. Oh, cute. It's going to be fine. I might make matching um, paper clips to go with these, and I'll show you how to do that sometime with the uh, like a banner type clip. Try it anyway. That'd be fun. I go in the back way. I probably should be going in the front way, but because it does look different, but that's all right. I always tend to go in the back way. I don't know why. I don't know why. I cut that really short, but that's okay. I'll leave it like that. Maybe later I'll add up. I'll, you know, I can change my mind or add a little lace to it or something else. You know, it's, it is what it is. Okay. I tend to do that. I tend to go a little short and then make it harder to put it through the holes. I do the same thing on paper clips. I don't know why I do that. I do not know why. I guess I'm trying to be frugal or stingy. <laughs> okay, probably stingy. No, I'm trying to make it so that it lasts so I had enough of this color actually to be quite honest with you. I just I knew I had one left and I needed to make it work. I needed to make it work, people. You can still see it says act one until I put this on. Which is a bummer. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little chill and chat. It's a little different than my normal, but I had a good time, and I hope you, I sure hope you did. And I hope you enjoyed this. This is a little different than what I normally do. Um, you know, I normally just, I don't do a lot of, um, I don't make a lot of uh, embellishments normally. Um, but I thought I would try my hand at it. It'd be fun. And I know a lot of people are tired of tags and stuff, but these are sewn, these are a little different, and they're with material, so that's one other thing, too, so. So anyway, there we go. I hope you guys like these. I thought they turned out were super cute, um, and I, I'm definitely gonna be using those in some journals that I've got up and coming. Okay, you guys, well, I hope you guys enjoyed these, um, little, these little mini file folders that I embellished, or actually altered, I should say, and, um, and I hope you uh, get out your sewing machines and make some and share online, okay? And also, if you haven't signed up for the for the for the flow, um, for the flow swap, do it. It'll be fun, I promise. All right, you guys. Hope all is well with everybody. Um, talk to you real soon. Take care now. Bye, guys.